Sahil Dave says, "Hi Kenny, love the recordings of you talking. Am I being an am an ambitious or lazy if I don't have a crazy big goal in life? I just want a source of income from a job and I don't I don't hate and spend my time doing things that I like. Spending time with my family, cooking, gardening, reading deep as books." So I've answered this question four times, Sahil, but uh, I want to dwell in this again. Have having no goal in life is I think a bad thing, but having a goal that doesn't match other people's goals is absolutely fine is what i think i had this conversation with a friend's mom so she was saying that she feels unambitious because she doesn't have big goals like her husband does but then we were we got into discussion about how just because your goals are not tangible doesn't mean they are not good enough goals or you're not ambitious while the husband's goal was to make money to have material things or get promoted Her goals are more. I want to have a good family, and have a good relationship. And I think that's not tangible, right? No one's reminding you like, "Hey, today, good job. You have a better relationship with your child." Because there's no system in place, I think we undermine that goal. Um, but she does actually have a goal that my main goal is to make sure I'm close to my family, and I'm aware of what's happening in my family, and I'm close to them. That's the goal. So. Sahil if you don't have a goal that's a problem. So I think you kind of just like praising yourself by saying I'm just simple but uh the point I'm trying to make is that you did do need to have a goal and I think that's how human beings function. We need something to call of our own and that's how we get self-worth. If you don't have something of your own you'll just have an identity crisis and you will attach your value to other people which is not healthy. You should have a true to thing even if it's as simple as I have a collection of plants in my balcony and I'll take care of them and that's a lame example but that's you can call that your own they exist because of you have something to call your own but have a goal it motivates your brain to do something and to get better otherwise you just feel lost you know that feeling of being lost it's like you don't have a nice goal Yo, if listening to this one hour long podcast isn't your thing, don't worry. This is a perfect channel for you. Subscribe for more such short recordings of me talking alone or with my friends. Whatever, it could be anything. But uh, you know, you know what they say: like, share, and subscribe. Because if you don't do it, they'll kill us. I'm kidding, <laughs> but please do.